Back home, all my cargo is spending a night under lock and key. Just packing up some uh, eBay orders tonight, so be um, I'll be doing stuff tomorrow morning, but just don't want to be too busy. Just going to Grand Rapids. Good, good guy here. Awesome. All right, it is uh, Saturday morning. Let's see if I can do this. Fourteen Bricklink. Two on Brickow, 1200 items, 355 lots, 457. I told myself if it's over 400, I might have to take a large one out, but it's 520. And I have a solid two hours of seven. I have two and a half hours because I gotta leave the house at 8:30, so we can easily do this. Let's do it. Order number one. So, you know, another great selection of parts. Thank you for all your hard work. See you next time. All right, thank you for making it worth it. We got this Harry Potter poster sold. Darth Vader TIE Fighter. Snape's class, Hagrid's Hut. Instructions that I just relisted, so that's awesome. And then a binacle, anything. It's a cataloger. It shows all the masks, I believe, on there, so that's pretty cool. That's a good resource. I mean, they all you can see all the um, the numbers on the mask, so it doesn't matter. But if you want to know the name of it, and some Harry Potter parts. I think this is all that except that one there. Yeah. Oh, so far I get moving. All right, this is the last piece. Am I zooming? Did it zoom on me? I hit the button. This is the last piece. You put your name on there. It's you. Name of order three, which is 119 lots. And here it is. A lot of just ones and twos. Some a little more, but it just hit 6 a.m. And the first order had instructions, so this program does not know how to quit. Order number six has a note. Love your YouTube videos. Thank you so much for coming in and placing an order. Let me know. We got two, two of those. We'll pull a couple parts here. If it goes backward, it's got room. The back uh, 536 and 653. 536 and 653. This dude. I uh, once, um, with these torsos, I put different arms on them and made Cincinnati Bengals fans, put them on eBay. Sold it for like 12 bucks because the torso was like 40 cents. And so I bought a couple of them and I've sold that a few times, a few this years ago. Don't know why I stopped because it's pretty cool. But there it is. Awesome. Thanks for the order again watching us. Another batch of eBay cents. <laughs> Hope we got it. The basement. I think that's 7.35 ish. But. Alright, I gotta leave in 20 minutes. Maybe get some footage, maybe not. Merry Christmas.
That's it. The show is over. I hit my sales goal I wanted for a place like this, so just step down there. That's a wrap. Ready to go home. Ten minutes away. Alright, Saturday night here. I just got done working for two hours. Got all packages. That's a four hundred dollar Brooklyn quarter. It has two Lego sets in it and eight other lots. So it's a good order. You'll find out. I'm just trying to keep everything every night packed because if you find out in the future, we might have to leave suddenly one of these nights. We'll see. Alright. I think this is 19 orders total on eBay here Monday morning. Nothing, uh, nothing too high dollar amount like I did Saturday night, man. Vacation Joker for 15 bucks. You know, there's some stuff like that. Before I just put up this sold for 14. So that's that's good to set sets for 20 bucks on sale. The Mandalorian set for like 22 bucks or something. Maybe more, I'm not sure, but anyway. On we go. We got lots of Bricklink quarters again. Alright, December 5th. Nine on Bricklink, eight on Brickell. Now I already Shipped out $600 on Saturday night after my show. <laughs> I kind of keep up on things. So I would have been over a thousand. So we're definitely still on a streak of over 500 a day for, I want to say, six straight days. So that is very promising. And you start uploading more. Um, 17 orders, 363 lots. It is 5.44 a.m. And uh, we get moving. So, I don't know what, there's a big one. There's 53 lots, 47 lots, 75 lots, 30, 29, so nothing too crazy. So far, order number six has got me uh, smiling. sets with these in there because that drawer is getting full. Filling drawers up this much is a bad idea. I'm trying to get 25 of these, I got 24. <laughs> um, what happens is they start out like you know 50-60% full but then you keep adding consolidating lots and then I, I keep throwing these in there so what I need to do is just pull out this drawer number and take all of these out and put them in a shoebox. It is 7.41 a.m. We just got number 10 pulled have it pulled. Seven more orders left and uh, one of them is 31 lots and two of them are like 29 the rest are about 10 or less so, so we are moving on. It's great. That is a lot of good mail for the last 48 hours. A lot of good stuff. All right getting some stuff done. <laughs> Not very many listed yet. We got a Brickling order to go through. I uh, just Went to look for a duster. I found this the kids' uh, the kids' uh, paint stuff. So it actually worked really well. I got it wasn't heavy dust on here, but it's mostly. Um, here we go. Let's go in the light. I mean, it was pretty dusty before, and it, you know it could use like a soap clean, but whoever wants to buy it, and do that again. Overall, the dust is gone. It's just a little look there. So this is. I looked at everything, I just got to grab a shark, an old dark gray shark, and this looks all complete, so we're going to put this bag it up and get it ready for photographs. Set number 6261, what is that worth? Oh, that's an awesome figure though. That's, I, don't, I haven't had that one for a while, that torso, I mean I could probably buy a torso and make a few bucks off it, but I like to buy things for profitable rates, so I just don't buy that stuff, so got all the extras and the goodies in there. Alright, we're working on the Bricklink order first. First up, we got that head. So I got I got this as a trade at the last mall show. The head is the eye has some problems, so we I think this is like 
four or five bucks for the head I paid. I'm not sure. But, yeah. So we got it replaced. And everything else is good. Just got one of those wither heads because I just sold one. And, uh,. So when I built this this other one I sold, this is the new one. This is the one I had. I was just missing one head. Just build them together. And easy relist. This is a rarity. Um, so I started buying Lego in summer of 2016. So that like... Over six years ago I started buying stuff. I've never... I might have had this figure before. I don't remember. I've, I don't have a card for it for an eBay store. So i got to create a card. So I just bought the heads and I was able to have the rest of the parts complete one three actually just got my oldest pending bricklink order <clears throat> i want to say order this early november so it was about six weeks roughly or five almost six maybe so finally got it and they're finally going to complete that bank <clears throat> been waiting i just needed i needed the right mold i had some of these i just needed the right variety of mold for these long pieces for that bank so that's really good stuff got some more of these in so, I got nine total sets now of video. I, I ordered 18, three different sets. So we got, uh, we're, we're getting this one, we're getting six, we're six of those, we're getting six of these, and six of these. So, I'm still waiting on the other boxes. But. Anyway, and then we got some plastic bags that apparently could be shipped media mail. I didn't know that. I had no idea you could do that. I thought media mail was just for books, not plastic baggies. You learn something new every day. Whoa. Yeah, I should have just shut the camera off instead of hitting myself. That's all right. All right. So I believe it's this one here. No. Then it's one of these. Nope. Then it must be this one. Yep. So we already uh, did a second verification on this and I realized I had the wrong mold variation when I did it, so that's why it wasn't done yet. So. We just needed the one more. I needed three at one time. I got two in one order, and then there's the two extras I got. And now we have the extra one. Monday at three, almost three thirty. I got to head to the post office, and let's just see in the Lego category what we got up to. Cause I just uh, I just relisted. 2055. So we had a lot of sales this weekend. I sold all these very expensive things. I sold a two hundred dollar figure. Lego store employee. I don't, think, I don't think I got that on camera either. Um, that just sold today, and the Gypsy or the Fortune Teller. It's very expensive for some reason. I don't know how that got went, went so high, but um, if you just go to eBay and my solds, anyone can see the solds. Like, you know, we sold the Evil Green Ninja, Scalador, Scales. The whole cheap, the flamingo. All right, and my um, my battery likes to die on this camera a lot, so that just happens. So there it is, Lego employee. I guess these were given just to Lego store employees from the manager at their discretion. I had it for like six months, and we sold it. Yeah. All right. eBay is done over there. It is 5:30 on December 6th. Four on Bricklink. Four on Brick Hall. $162. What happened? The streak has ended. Whew. It was four or maybe five straight days at 500 or more a day, so that was a good streak, but I'm happy to pick 59 up lots today because I have backlog busting plans again, grabbing bags from under the stairs. I am excited to get, get this going real fast this morning. Slight change of plans. We have 13 of these. 75319. Lots of minifigs. Somebody wanted one for Christmas, so I, I was kind of hiding them. Not sure when I got them, so uh, we're going to part these out. It's a cool 
cool piece. Um, right now, since it's early enough, I can get it done or stuff put away. We would know what it is at a certain point. So I'm gonna do this, and then I got I got some Brickling orders. This is a 50 lot order. It, this store house it seems to have like not too many of the same parts. Like I got a couple of those hairs, but there's like 40 different parts in here. We'll complete some mini pigs for sure on that one. A couple others I gotta go through. I'm gonna do this first, then we'll do that, and then I'll get the backlog going. It probably worked. The last few Wednesdays I've been doing sets like this in the morning on Wednesday. So instead of that, I'm just gonna do it on Tuesday and then do backlog tomorrow during the morning. Alright, it's just before seven. I just got the bag one open. You don't have to go with the bag one, you can go to whatever I'm doing bag one and two with the minifigs first and take care of those before I even do that bag so that there, there's no evidence what it is. So, that's what we're doing. Let's go. Alright, bag one conquered. Bag two is a lot faster than bag one. Like eight minutes faster. So I don't know if I should just go for bag three real quick. Yeah, let's just get it all done and then I'll go for that. So I've, I still got to go 45 minutes. There we go, one hour and 14 minutes. One hour, 14 minutes. And we are done with 3,400 parts sorted. Gotta get more moving here. The thing that I'm doing to conserve space now, um, like this piece is in 38, 43, 38, 44, which is two of these bigger drawers right here. So what I'm going to do is remove this one and we're going to put this in a bag with the new stuff and uh, put it in a shoe box instead of using up two of these drawers that are easy to pull parts from faster. So do this and I'll put it in NSB 48. So we go 3843 comma space. NSB 048. Bag it up. There it is. All right, the deed is done. Ended up being 3,300 items uploaded, 560. So 20 times 13, 20 dollars times 13, 260. And there's also over. About 20 minifigs not included, so the minifigs are the value in this set for sure. So that's another 200 bucks, easy. And uh, that is done. I already put everything away. And it is 9:38 a.m. Gotta get some breakfast. I only had my I had my second breakfast first.